So in aortic regurgitation, there's a ton of clinical signs, mostly caused by the increased amount of blood flow going out and coming back in from the regurgitant murmur. One of those signs we've created here today essentially is taking the Corrigan's pulse. When you see the giant pulse going back and forth and creating it into an auditory version using a Doppler. So all you simply do here, and I have Balfour here who's going to help me uh, demonstrate this. Balfour's going to show the contraction of the artery. You can see the contractions of the artery using this stick here. And then we'll go ahead and put the Doppler over his other carotid artery. So essentially what we're doing here is taking a Doppler, placing it over the carotid artery, and tilting it downward a little bit. After you hear the systolic component, you hear a diastolic reflux of blood flow back towards the heart. The preceding program is copyrighted by the Board of Trustees of the Leland Stanford Junior University. Please visit us at med.stanford.edu.